living the disciplines that help them grow close to God. If, if you look at, let's say, who was successful in scripture, I don't think anybody would argue that Jesus wasn't incredibly successful pleasing God. If you look at their lives, one thing I can tell you is that Jesus never, ever, ever said, but I just can't find the time to pray. I'm so busy and these disciples, they're wearing me out. Peter just gets all up on my nerves. I wish I had more time to spend with God, but I just don't have the time to spend with God. Jesus never ever said that. What you'll see is a consistent habit of breaking away from the crowds to have intimate fellowship with God. Daniel, he's a fantastic guy. If I want to model after the life of someone who stood out and had great faith, I want to live like Daniel. Why was Daniel successful? Why was it amongst a bunch of other young men, did he stand out to all the leaders as godly, gifted, talented, and different? Why is it that when thrown into a den full of lions because of his obedience to God, he was able to stand strong, trust in God, and come out alive on the other side? It's because he had the systems in place that led to a life of faith and faithfulness. What was his system? For years and years and years, Daniel had predecided that three times a day, every day, he stops to spend time with God. Three times a day. If you wanna grow in your faith, and if you want to be more faithful, if we will fix what we do, how we live, the habits in our life, the outcomes will fix themselves. What does our enemy do? Our enemy tries to connect our failures to identity. You failed, so you are a failure. You did bad, therefore you are bad. And this is how it might play out in your life. Well, this is just the way I am. I'm not a disciplined person. I'm not an organized person. I've never been good in relationships. I, I just can't seem to get it done. It's identity. No single action will change your identity, but consistent actions over time start to change how you feel about yourself and change your identity. Because successful people do consistently what other people do occasionally. Who do you wanna be? I wanna be like Jesus. He conformed me to his image. And if you're becoming more like Christ, you know who you are, then you know what to do because truly God-honoring people do consistently what other people do occasionally.